The Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries stocks rainbow trout every winter at multiple community fishing ponds throughout the state through the Get Out and Fish program. Rainbow trout are a non-native species that provide an exciting, unfamiliar fishing experience for many local anglers. Keep on watching for tips that may help you catch your first rainbow trout. A variety of baits or lures can be used to catch rainbow trout. In this video, we'll cover how to fish with the whole kernel corn, power bait, and small spinners or rooster tails. We'd love to hear which other baits or tips that have helped you catch rainbow trout. If you're fishing with corn or power bait, you're going to want to start with using the right sized hook. Smaller hooks will help catch rainbow trout as they have a smaller sized mouth. Smaller hooks like this number eight help to prevent lip damage or breakage to the fish's delicate mouth, which can lead to the fish getting off of the hook. A shorter shank that allows the bait to almost completely conceal the hook works best. You're going to want your fishing rod to give a slight bend with a light tug. A fishing rod with a moderate action and light power will provide sensitivity for monitoring the light bites from these fish. Avoid brightly colored or not clear fishing line when fishing for rainbow trout. A well-hidden hook and light leader line works well because rainbow trout have great eyesight and hit lightly on the bait. The first bait we're going to talk about is the power bait. This comes in many different colors, including colors with glitter, which provides an extra shine that catches these fish's attention. These can be slid on to a small hook and left to float within the water column while waiting for a bite. Using the bait to cover the hook, remember to keep it well hidden. You can fish using a bobber if your hook is heavy enough to sink the bait or you can set up a weight and leader line to help keep the bait from floating to the top of the water. Make adjustments to prevent your bait from sitting on the bottom. This type of bait does a good job at mimicking insect larvae that they would eat in the wild or hatchery pellets that the fish would eat when farm raised. If you don't have time to run to a sporting goods store, wet kernels of corn work just as well and may be sitting in your home's pantry. For a more active fishing experience, a small rooster tail or spinner can be used and works by steadily reeling in and recasting. The small, shiny, swimming, fish-like appearance works great at catching the attention of hungry rainbow trout. Try fanning out your casts in different directions while waiting for a strike. It's important not to give up too quickly, as these fish can sometimes be picky eaters. Other tips include fishing at different times of the day and during different weather conditions. Visit the website at the end of this video to view a list of all ponds that are part of the Get Out and Fish program, stocking schedule, and events in an area near you. Most Get Out and Fish ponds have a five fish limit per person on rainbow trout. Please follow all other state regulations and remember to purchase your fishing license before planning a fishing trip.